The flying fins have arrived in Montreal, complete with stage fright. A little bit nervous, I have to say. The fishbowl that surrounds the Montreal Canadiens welcomed 1993 first round draft pick Saku Koivu and 1994 fourth round choice Marko Kiprusov from Turku, Finland. Both were met by a horde of reporters last night at Dorval and today at the morning news conference. The French morning papers billed Koivu as something of a savior for the Habs, who missed the playoffs last year for the first time in 25 years. Like Koivu needs that extra pressure. But I don't want to take any, any extra pressure on myself because of this. I'm just doing my, my job. The limelight in Montreal belongs to the great Patrick Roy and center Pierre Turgeon. But just in case, the Canadians are trying to downplay the arrival of Koivu. Not all the pressure and all the focus should be on Cuivo. This year we have Turgeon who starts the year with us. Turgeon gets most of the ice at center, and that's the way we could break him in slowly. We're going to break him in slowly, and we're going to try to avoid to build him up too high. Koivu is a speedy center who has a nose for the net, but the knock against him is his size. Listed at 5 foot 9 and 165 pounds, is he durable enough? I coach Denis Savard. Steve Eisenman and Doug Gilmore. And those three guys are going to the Hall of Fame. And they came in and everybody questioned their size and they became impact players. I just have to be a little bit quicker and faster than the big defensemen so they can't catch me. The wild card remains the 23-year-old defenseman, Marco Kiprusov, who signed a two-year deal worth 900,000 U.S. I don't think, uh, Herb, that I, I, I paid that kind of money to go and play in Fredericton. Savar maintains Kiprusov is a good all-around defenseman, capable of playing in any situation. But if Kiprusov is going to play in Montreal, he's going to have to get rid of that stage fright. And I just want to give my best effort and let's see how far it takes me. Caroline Corey, CBC Sports, Montreal.